Hello guys, welcome back to my video. My name is Rohit and you're watching Tech Jakers and in this video I'm gonna show you guys how you can fix Forza Horizon 5 startup crashing issue. So game is being released on Steam and Xbox yesterday and everyone is facing startup crashing issue. So let's see how we can fix it and we have a couple of steps so just make sure that you watch till the end of this video and try all these methods uh, to make sure that uh, your problem get fixed. So first thing you need to make sure that you are on the latest version of your graphics card for that if you are an Nvidia user then you can just go to search and search for GeForce Experience so I already have it here uh, so once that open you can just uh, do it in case if you are an AMD user you can open that control catalyst or something like that I don't remember exactly uh, I was an old AMD user uh, but basically something like that then you can just uh, search for the up driver update or something like that in case of GeForce experience you can just go to drivers tab and there you can see check for updates so if I do it I can see that I am on the latest version of game ready driver so in case if you are not on the latest driver then uh, the GeForce experience pops up something like this where you can update just update it and install it and restart the system and you are good to go so once that is done you can close this the second step is that you need to make sure that you disable your antivirus so in your case you may be using some external antivirus like Avast or uh, something Norton or something like that then you need to make sure that you disable that uh, in my case I'm using just uh, Windows security I feel like it is good enough for me so you just need to go inside this virus and threat protection inside that I can see manage settings and here real-time protection I can turn it off so in case of other antivirus they provide some like timer so we can just set that one that's really good feature of having antivirus so that is done the next part is that you need to add some permission to Forza Horizon 5 launcher for that you need to find Forza Horizon launcher so in case if you are a game pass user then you won't be able to find it anywhere in case you are a steam user then you can simply locate the folder and do and follow along with me but i am a xbox game pass user so i need to find the location of the game and also add some change some properties basically of that folder for that uh, you can just go to this search this pc and search for windows app and you can search for it uh, but it may take some time uh, but in my case it's already showing basically then you can see where the game is installed actually in my case i i have it on both for both drives uh, but i know that game is on d drive so i just open d drive and i can see that windows apps is here in case if it is not visible then you can just go to views and show and also make sure that hidden items are visible so just right click on it and then go to more options and then you need to find properties there you need to go inside security tab and then go to advanced and here I am already the owner of this folder but in your case it's uh, saying something like uh, there is no ownership or something like that then just click on change and then you need to enter the username of uh, your system basically if you don't know what is your username then you can just go to this PC go to C drive and then go to users and there you can find the username of your system so once you get the username then you can just go back to that tab and enter that here so in my case it's G -S -S -A -M. Uh, so once that is done you can just click on ok and a new pop-up comes up where you need to make sure that you tick this one replace owner on sub containers and objects and click on apply and uh, a pop-up comes up just click on ok and click on ok so once that is done you can click on ok and then you can go back to that folder so if you try to open now some prompt appears you can just click on ok after that it won't comes up so now you need to find the game basically the game won't be like uh, forza horizon 5 it will be some random letters and numbers maybe some code names like that uh, so in case uh, if you can't find forza horizon 5 then just go through each of these folders and to find the game in my case i know that the forza horizon is the first one i'll just open this one and here I can find Forza Horizon 5 application file just right click on it then go to properties and then go to security so sorry not security go to compatibility and there you can find the first option is that disable full screen optimization enable that one and also enable this run this uh, this program as administrator and also go to change high dpi settings and in here you need to come down and high dpi scaling override just override it and make sure that you selected application click on ok and click on apply and click on ok 
so now you are good to go if you try to play it from here you won't be able to play you need to open xbox game pass or sorry xbox basically uh, but in your case if you are using steam then you just open steam and then open the game from there i hope this helped you guys if it helped you a like and a comment is well uh, appreciated um thanks for watching see you soon in another video